today I'm going to tell you how to give the perfect gift. But first, how not to give the perfect gift. Even if you're trying not to make the perfect gift, I don't know why you click on this video, but don't use wrapping paper. We use 4 million tons of that stuff every year. It's thrown away, it's not recyclable, it's a waste of money. And time, should I keep going? Just do what I do, except not. It has a reusable bag instead of wrapping paper, and it has tissue paper that can also be reused. But then inside is this, and look, at the amount of packaging. So yeah, cardboard boxes can be recycled, but look, we have this extra cardboard for no reason. And we have this random thing. And we have this wrapped in plastic for no reason that is also not recyclable. And then we have this camera that is wrapped in this weird stuff that maybe can be used, but it's meant to be thrown away. This packaging is also meant to be thrown away. Like this. Okay, it's a number six, which means it's not recyclable, or whatever that's supposed to say. Another thing I hate about plastic packaging is that it makes super annoying, crinkly sounds, which is why I had to mute it. That is why you make your own gifts, because you can decide how much packaging you get. Just look at the amount of packaging! I mean, what a waste! Wasting packaging is like wasting money, but worse, because not only does it hurt you, it hurts the environment. I hate store-bought stuff slash stuff that's bought online, but like... It's an awesome camera that can connect to the internet. Yeah. Now, actually, how to give the perfect gift. No rubbing paper, reusable bag, and reusable tissue. And inside, we have a fidget spinner. Yeah, I know fidget spinners are really old, but it's homemade, and it took a lot of time to make. And that's what's most important. So yeah, I can tell you this is not the best fidget spinner, but paint it in. Make it yours, and fidget spinners are so not in right now, but... I just remember making small cups. I think it would be a pretty good homemade gift. Sometimes it's hard to find a, a time to make a homemade gift like this, so sometimes you just want to buy... Always buy eco-friendly holiday gifts if you don't have any time to make your own. Earth 911 has everything. For example, here on Uncommon Goods, you can shop and pick non-profit, and they donate one dollar. And they have tons of unique gifts that you don't need to make yourself, which is great. And also, if you're a fashion there is a link to 35 brands of fair trade and sustainability. Here we have notebooks that are made from 100% recycled paper. And here is all the green stuff for the card. An online gift or store about gift to people or stores, but at least try to be aware of this. The logo, which means it's from responsible sources, which means it does not hurt the environment, it does not kill trees. Well, or they, it's just from recyclable sources, which is just so much better. Because trees are for breathing. And I know this is a band-aid box, and you would not give someone a band-aid box, but just try. I want to give more valuable gift this year for the holidays. Consider spending more quality time with your friends and family, because that is the most valuable gift. And that's what friends and family are for. Spend quality time and enjoy each other's company. For example, you could go for coffee or a smoothie, but don't use these containers. They're not, you can only use them once. What's the point of using something only once and throwing it away forever? That's why you use these for hot drinks and for cold drinks. Save about a thousand or more disposable cups every year. Boom. Or you go for a concert at Kennedy Center or some casual movie. Or you could spend time on a trail, on a nature walk. Or you could just spend time in your backyard with your friends and family. That's the most important thing you should do during the holidays.